Hi there, I am Novel from iExpert and uh, as always iExpert give you something really creative, uh, creative design software uh, tutorials and, and you can uh, get in our channel everything is uh, every, uh, every kind of software uh, uh, tutorials is uh, almost free so don't waste your time let's uh, jump to the main thought so uh, first of all uh, today we are going to learning adobe illustrator so what is the adobe illustrator is a vector and graphics editor and graphics design program developed and marketed by adobe so this is the adobe icon so very fast you have to install the adobe illustrator software on your computer so that's that's when you just uh, install on your computer so you get a surface uh, adobe illustrator uh, dashboard like this so you don't worry about that if you have adobe illustrator cc version or old version don't worry about that so everything is almost same every work is almost same so if you uh, if you have some creating talent you can make a design any kind of version with it so don't worry about that just download and uh, just install and if you download it and purchase it okay that's your uh, you can do that and uh, very first when you just install your uh, adobe illustrator uh, page so you get a pages like that so then so when you want to art anything when you want to design anything so what do you need first so you need a paper right you need paper right so then in that how we need a paper so if you want to design so this is our uh, all the tools in here so we have to first of need we need a paper so what to do then uh, go to file then new and you can also press ctrl n on your keyboard ctrl n again told that ctrl n on your keyboard so you get a uh, pop-up page like this so when you just uh, get a pop-up page like this in here i i know you may say that so you i know how to take a page but in here a lot of options you in here so that's really important so you know in here you see this that's a recent mode and uh, that's the mobile and that's the web so what is that so when you are working on the ui design and a mobile layer, so in here they make also their uh, also page size in here so iphone page size uh, and it's also the web so when you're web designing so you can uh, page web designer so page in here like this and and also so when you just working on print fu print function so you see that that's in here print so you get that a4 a4 a3 b4 b5 so everything in here so now come to the question so you see your uh, you want to be work on the inches right or centimeter or anything so what how to how to change it so you know in here you see this you see this the point the option so this is the cursor when you just click on here so you get a uh, picas inches millimeter centimeter and uh, pixels option so when you just working on inches so you just click on here so you get inches so you can you can randomly create your page so just take an uh, ju just uh, put in uh, any numbers what uh, you want so you want to put your custom numbers in here custom page size in here so that's a pretty much easy and interesting thought so that's how you can uh, in the you can make your any kind of page so but but i'm working on a so make it a four size in any now so just uh, put it inches and uh, in here the advanced option so you know so when you just add click this advanced arrow in here this arrow then you get a color mode so now cmyk so in here you see that the rgb colors and the cmyk color so when you working on the something for your design so you can working on rgb so you if you are raw colors and very bad colors so you can work on rgb colors but when you uh, when you work on this uh, printing uh, printing section so you can use the cmyk so in here you can choose rgb and cmyk in here so that's pretty much interesting and thought so always remember that so in here remember that so you don't have the cmyk and rgb option in here because uh, so when you just click in this advanced option in here so you get a uh, pop up uh, so it's uh, up and uh, you choose from here here cmyk or rgb like this so 
you choose the rgb or you choose the cmyk so your wish there so then create so when we just press the create you get a page you see that we get the page our new page in here so that's it and i think uh, this you uh, gives you some information so you can use it so you read uh, uh, cmyk rgb and how to change this uh, inches to millimeter centimeter everything so that's it for today's and i i really uh, invite you to watch every videos uh, to you know so when you learn this adobe illustrator is perfectly you can learn adobe animate so every kind of adobe software so this is a really essential to first you know, learn adobe illustrator so you, when you make your design you make your custom design adobe illustrator is really important and as always if you think that's really worth your time so please uh, make this subscribe button you know when you press the subscribe button this family will be, uh, will be bigger and you if you have time i must suggest to visit our old channel so when you just visit you know you will understand how many informative channel is that so i will really invite you and uh, please stay with us and support us to make this channel bigger and see you another class take care bye bye uh, you get this your what you want and wish you proper respect your time and if you think that's really worthful for you, please subscribe and make this family bigger. Uh, if we make it together, we can make these changes. And thank you so much.